What's going on, my good peoples? This your boy Ella, and I am coming to you straight from the sound box. And we are talking about impact on this video. In this video, should I say, this is Studio One Three, and I just want to show you something real simple. I keep getting these questions. All right, these questions involves routing you know using your instruments inside whatever instruments that you're using but we're just going to use impact for the moment so we're going to go here to instruments and we're going to grab impact i am bragging dragging i meant dragging drag <laughs> i'm bragging all right i'm bragging we're going to just go here to something i have opened in my folder here so we're going to put kick here all right so let's go to another folder and let's grab some claps okay good enough we're gonna put that on pad two and let's go for like oh i love how that sound that's pretty awesome all right so say we 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 want to route everything over see right now everything is coming out of stereo right You know what? I'm inspired to do something right now. We're going to create something right now. Wait. Let's get our tempo together. What's going on here? Mm, let's bring it up to 90. Okay. Two, three, four. Okay. Didn't work that way. Cause I think I, <laughs> yeah, I don't have my keyboard as you can see. So let's go another route. Let's actually insert it in. Cool, no problem. All right, so let's go and no, I like this better. All right, so here's my kick. Okay, so here we go. And I think we're gonna go to our clap here. Okay, so then we're gonna come here for our for our snare. No, we're gonna move that up. Okay, cool. All right. Now, as you can see, we still coming out of stereo here, right? Now, when routing you need to it's, it's really simple you know it's really simple <laughs> this is how simple it is you come down here to the bottom of the pad here and you just change your routing information mono one mono two mono three but you could do stereo one stereo two but i just really prefer to wait let's see let's see if that really sounds better in stereo let's let's check that out uh, I don't I don't notice that much of a of a difference, but sometimes when you're dealing with samples and it has that like if your sample is stereo, like sometimes snares and, and finger snaps and things like that, it, it has though you know stereo, it, it's a stereo sample. You might want to stick with the stereo, and you can do that by going here. But for this instance, this you know this example, we're just gonna stick with a mono because mono hits a little harder to me in my opinion all right and keep in mind because it hits harder your volume is going to hike as you can see you can kind of hear the difference in the volume itself and the cool thing about this is you can label everything right here let's say that's the kick this is my clap and this is my hat. I hope that's my hat. Hold on. Okay. Just got to shift all of the names. So that's obviously wrong. So um, we're going to fix that. But let me show you something. If you go back to the instrument itself, this is how you gain access to everything that you see visually in your mixer. So in this instance, 
let's deactivate this here this one right here because i just want to see the clack and see i obviously have to rename that but that's all i want to see here now this here is the at the impact instrument itself why do i want to keep that there when it's not really doing anything you know what i mean so i'm just gonna deactivate that there all right and then we're gonna uh there we go let's turn off this metronome here because it's bothering me there we go so obviously <laughs> let's rename that this is my clap here and that's my hat boom and we're just gonna bring everything down okay and that's really as simple as it is and you can choose to hide stuff if you if you like you know by doing this but the fact that they are over here in the first place the the only way you would see it over here is if you activate everything from this window here you, know, you can choose what you want to see and so forth right and that's really you know that's really all to it in regards to routing everything now and that the whole purpose of routing is to have control now your your studio one system may look more like this when you first log in no not like that it, it'll look something like this it'll probably be like longer like that or something like that i'll i like it short you know i like you know that's just me and then you have to hit this button here to get access to the inserts and sends so say i want to add a compressor to my kick or something like that or all of them <laughs> i got them all selected that's the reason why it is it went in you know just everywhere but say for instance i just wanted my compressor on my kick you know what i mean you can definitely hear how I am crushing the heck out of my kick. Compressing the heck out of my kick on its own without even touching my claps. You understand? And say I want a reverb on my claps. I can do that. I'm making sure I'm glad. Okay. You know what I'm saying? And let's say we add something totally different to our clap. Let's say we let's go for EQ. You know, let's go for Pro EQ and say we want to we want to do something play around with the the EQ here you can hear how we making a difference to each individual track you know what i'm saying say i want to send some things to a reverb and i'm just going to go to another reverb just just to show y'all how how dope this is or a flanger let's go for a flanger what the heck right that sounds dope that is dope to me i don't know about y'all <laughs> but just to show you guys how easy and simple this is and, and how dope this is all right i hope you guys learned something that's really all i want to show you um, I got a, you know, like I said, I got a uh, request to do this and I just want to, um, you know, show you guys how it works. Hope you learned something. If you got any suggestions as to what I should focus on next, please feel free and jot that down in the comment section. I appreciate it. This is your boy, Ella. Remember, music is art. You're the artist. Paint your picture.